once we hit 1K subscribers, I mean, like I said, we could give away a Gucci belt, a Cuban bracelet, um, and all kinds of stuff, some Jordans. You know, I like all that stuff, man. So... What is up YouTube fam man, we are back at the trap house and with another video for you guys. Um, today we are actually going to go over um, this Gucci belt review. Right here. Um, I'm going to explain to you guys, you know, the belt that it is, how it comes packages up, the pricing which is the really most important thing for you guys if you ever want to buy a Gucci belt. Um, and pretty much, you know, just my experience at the Gucci store. Um, the, closest Gucci store that I have is pretty much my keyboard if I want to get online you know obviously but the nearest store that I can physically walk into it is in the International Mall in Tampa which is probably like 45 to an hour away actually right down the road from the Bucks Stadium where you know um, they had the Super Bowl uh, just happened recently but um, so I bought my Gucci belt probably two weeks ago for my daughter's quinceanera um, if you missed those videos, you know, this is going to be the, the, the thumbnail for it. Um, check it out. You know, I think there's three videos for it. You know, check them out. Like, comment, you know, on it. You know, they're pretty good. Um, if you guys like Quinceanera videos and, you know, party stuff, you know, that, that gives you a quick rundown of it. But, um, so yeah, I, I wanted to wear a nice belt because I pretty had a nice outfit for that day. So, you know, I wanted a new belt. Um, my belt still looked nice and everything, but, you know, I, I wanted to feel fresh that day because it was a very important day for my daughter, number one, and number two, that was one of the fun my days too, because I wanted to feel um, extra special, you know what I'm saying? I, you know, we dropped a little few bands on this party, so you know, why not go the extra mile and look a little bit fancy, you know? Um, we work hard, we grind hard, you know, we save, so you know, why not? But, um, I recorded actually a few videos um, when I was actually inside the Gucci store, which that's how we'll start this, uh, um, out after this little baby intro. Um, I didn't really want to take my camera, which I'm recording on here right now, my blogger cam, because if you're like a popular blogger or someone like famous or athlete or something, I mean, obviously they'll let you go in there with the camera. But me, you know, I'm just an average Joe. Um, but uh, I just recorded with my phone. They didn't say anything. I mean, I know a few people inside the Gucci store. I've actually bought a few things, you know, inside the Gucci store. So when they type in my name, man, you're gonna see like, man, I, I spent some bands in that thing. You know what I'm saying? You know, I bought my, my kids stuff, a woman something, you know, all kinds of stuff. Um, so, you know, they, they, they know me and they're by computer, you know what I'm saying? And the numbers don't lie. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and drop these clips and then I'm gonna get back to you guys and, you know, um, show you the bell, you know, explain stuff and everything. Don't forget to um, subscribe for number one. Hit that little button right there. Um, hit that thumbs up real quick. And, you know, comment. You know what I'm saying? Comment. You know what I'm saying? That would help out really big time. I appreciate you guys. And even more if you guys subscribe. Because at 1,000 uh, subscribers, um, I am going to be doing giveaways. videos were from when I went to the Gucci store in Tampa, Florida. Um, man, I just walked in there, you know, I went straight to the, the belt section. Um, the store is pretty badass. They switched it. It used to be closer to where the Tesla's at, where they have the cars at, but they went ahead and moved it a little bit more further down a few stores because they needed a bigger area. Um, it was like black and, you know, um, the displays cases were look nice. But now they have this whole like jungle look, you know, switched over to like green concept, you know what I'm saying? Um, which is pretty cool, you know what I'm saying? I like it, it gives it more um, vibes in there when you walk in there, um, and it just makes you want to buy something. You know, like I said, I, I have already bought a Gucci belt before, and <clears throat> I always save my bags, you know what I'm saying? Because I keep them up as memories to tell myself like, damn, you know what I'm saying? 
actually did it. I bought that. And this bag is from 2015, I think, maybe 16. But this is the very first bag that my Gucci belt, when I first went, when I bought my first Gucci belt, came in. With. Look at this thing. It has like the Gucci, you know, print on it. 3D. It has that. You know, the bag is pretty cool. Um, you know, here it is. All that. This is what my Gucci belt, when I first got it, came in. Um, they transitioned over to the new green look. You know, the green look, you know, looks pretty cool. Although, see what I'm saying? The brown looks good. But that's just like that high end stuff. And the green just makes you look like you want to go buy some more. It don't really have like nothing that says Gucci other than the actual like print label that they have on it. But I mean, it is fancy. This stuff. It has like texture on it. Look at it. Little bags like that. But these bags are like real deal. You know what I'm saying? Like that you're not, you know, um, play around when it comes to you know packaging your stuff. All right. So let me take the box out that it comes out with. So when you get your Gucci belt, you get it in this box. On it and it has a design on it. See what I'm saying? It comes wrapped up in a bow with this Gucci uh, little like ribbon strip. You see it? With this Gucci ribbon all over it, and it comes with a real nice bow right here. But I took the bow off, and it'll probably be impossible for me to make it look that nice again. Only females know how to make stuff look like real badass with doing stuff like that. But Go ahead and un unbox this thing. Okay, so it comes with like a magnetic thing. You see what I'm saying? Like, like I said, Gucci does not play around when it comes to packaging their stuff. You know what I'm saying? If you get what you pay for, you know, if you spend 500 plus, a thousand dollars plus on a belt, you are gonna get top dog stuff. You feel me? Like, you ain't no 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 chump getting a, a regular belt at Gucci. You know, they're gonna take care of you. So. It has a magnetic thing right there. Open it. And it comes like this wrapped up. Even this paper has like the Gucci print and the Gucci um, logo on it, which is like, you know, badass. Like I have still the tissue from this one where it's like Gucci print everywhere and the tissue. Like I say, I save all this stuff, man. You know what I'm saying? You know, as a memory to show myself, man, you, you worked hard, you got something nice, and you know, you're good. So then, you know, open it. Then it comes in this, you know. Let me fix my camera real quick. So it comes in this bag right here. You know, Gucci on both sides. And the bag is like real nice, you know, material, you know. And it doesn't have no graphics on it. But like the material right off the bat, man, that thing is no joke. Like it, it's nice. Um, you know, I'm gonna try to, you know, save this belt, make, make it look nice. Um, keep it in the little box that it comes with inside here so I can conserve the belt so it stays looking A1, man, because this belt was a little baby expensive. Um, so I'm gonna take care of it because I do want to use this belt when I go out um, and, you know, just take care of it pretty much because it was pretty pricey. But yeah, so it comes inside here, so let me take out the, the Gucci belt. Alright, so this is how it comes when as soon as you get it out. Um, man, this black leather, if you were to feel this thing, like, this is like some alien type of leather. You know, it's like real, like, nice. You know, the, the gloss in it, look at it, it has a texture. So let me show you what the buckle head looks like. Look at that thing. This is like stainless steel metal. I doubt this thing will ever break, you know, anything. You know, you can knock somebody out if you really want to with this thing. Um, but this is the, the, the Gucci uh, buckle that I purchased. Um, man, th this belt is like no joke. You know what I'm saying? Like, I love this belt. Um, it's been perfect. I feel comfortable in it. Like I said before, I was never a belt guy until I started wearing my Gucci belts. Look, I'm going to show you. Now, don't laugh at my Gucci belt. You know, real quick, comment down below. Do you like the belt? Do you like the box? Do you like the bag? Do you like the uh, little sack it came in? Or do you even like the video? You know, comment down below. Let me know what you guys think so far. You know, okay. So I'm gonna show you my Gucci belt. Don't laugh at it. Uh, 
I mean, it was my first Gucci belt that I bought in 2015, 16 maybe. And man, I put this thing through some war. But man, uh, I'll never throw this belt away. I'm gonna keep wearing it so it, 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 it can't hold on my pants no more. Uh, but look at it. So this is my first Gucci belt right here is a black. And it has the um, black with the gray stripe on it. But look, I'm gonna show you how much torment I put. Like, this thing is like sagging. It's like angled out, look at that thing. My mom sews uh, boat campuses, so I had her sew it back on because it's actually ripped one time. Because like I said, uh, man, I put this belt through so much. Um, but man, it's still a warrior. It still hasn't gave out on me. The Gucci head, I mean, I don't know if you can tell it has some scratches. I know I can see the scratches, but I don't know if, if you guys can tell. Um, man, but this thing, like, man, I wear this thing every single day. Like I said, I'm going to wear this belt till the very end. Um, it's always been my favorite belt. I like to wear black belts because it matches a lot. I'm not big into the uh, the ones with the Gucci print or any of that stuff. I just like solid black, you know, or maybe I just got that black with that silver stripe on it. If they were to make another one, I'd probably grab it too. And I just got to grind hard and, and get it, you know, right? So I put my belt back on. Sometimes I feel like a little kid, but I'm... All right, so back. So... Man, you'll probably see some fake ones out there. I'm going to tell you a quick tip on how you know if it's a fake belt. When you look at the belt, the belt will look like, man, like average size buckle. But when you see the one where that has like a huge buckle on it, um, man, that thing is fake. They do have some styles. They do have some styles that the buckle is rather big. But you know when it's that style because I think it comes with the little diamonds on it or whatever. But usually like it's for like females. Um, but... Other than that, if you got a, a a male rocking a Gucci belt and it's just got like, if you look at me like, dang, that belt buckle's pretty big, then it is like more than likely fake. You know what I'm saying? It, it is fake. Um, but this one is like, you look at it, it's almost as big as the width of the belt. So it's just probably like two hairs bigger, but man, like it, it's, it looks like it fits the belt. It doesn't look awkward on it. See what I'm saying? And um, man, the belt, Awesome, fits me good. I love wearing it. Um, I'll probably wear it this now. Weekend. What you guys probably been wondering is how much did I actually pay for the Gucci belt? Let me get the receipt. Even the receipt is pretty gangster, you know, the way how they give you the receipt. They'll come out and give it to you in this like little baby portfolio thing and you know, be like, oh, here you go, blah, blah, blah. And I even keep the Gucci belt or even the Gucci receipt. Because man, this paper is like thick. Like I said, man, they make you feel luxurious you know what I'm saying when you buy something like this I have been buying nothing from Louis Vuitton yet um, I'll probably try to do that for Christmas time or something like that I'll buy my mom a, a purse or a, a belt or some sandals or some um, heels or something I don't know you know I'll buy her something nice because she helped me a lot for my daughter's party so I gotta you know show her some love but even the, the receipt look at this thing it says Gucci on it like to me that looks dope right off the bat saying I like to do you know a little bit of like stunting flexing and this is flexing right here man you know so I'm gonna show you guys what I paid for the belt real quick comment down below how much you think I paid for the belt 500 600 700 1000 1200 what, what do you guys think all right so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys exactly how much I paid for the belt you know saying because we don't lie around here it was 480, 490, I think, plus the tax with a grand total of it was it says 525.75. You know that's how much I paid for the belt. 525 dollars. You know what I'm saying? It is a little expensive, but man, if you like to stunt, you know, look good. You know, try to be like your favorite rapper, favorite celebrity, uh, favorite narco, whatever you want to do, man. Like. Man, you, you have to pay the, the, the cost to be the boss, man. You know, simple as that, you know. And I've worked hard, you know, I grind, I'm a barber, I do a little bit of car stuff here and there. And, you know, I'm self-employed, so, like, I mean, I, I, I try to do a little bit of extra and just to buy that little bit of extra nicer stuff. Okay, so let's close this video out. Overall, I love the bell. Was a bit pricey, but man, that's what the price you gotta uh, pay to, to to be the boss or to play. You know what I'm saying? How they say. Um, 
yeah, man, you know what I'm saying? Like, badass belt, badass box, bag, everything, man, you know what I'm saying? So, go buy yourself a Gucci belt, man. Save up, man, you know. Stand out a little bit. You know, I'm not, not saying that that's the thing to do, but, man, if you feel like, man, you, you be trying to be in the club, hanging out, Trying to stand out from others, man. Go buy a Gucci belt, man. It'll make you feel good. I know it makes me feel good. You know, I love to put my belt on, man. And real quick, man. My thing with buying like stuff like this is if you never go ahead and push yourself to save that extra dollar and to spend that extra dollar, you never know what you can really buy or do. You feel me? If, if I would have sat here and listened to everybody, like, no, you can't do that. And you know, enjoy life, man. You only got one uh, life to live. If you want to be like a favorite rapper, like I said, it, all that stuff, man. You know, just it, 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 it costs a little bit of money to do that. You know, in the real world, you know what I'm saying. Um, so yeah, man. You know, 525, Gucci belt, good experience, man. You know, go try it. You know, um, let me know what you think about this video. Subscribe, number one. Drop that comment. Hit that like button. Um, like I said, I am doing giveaways. Um, I, once we hit 1k subscribers, I mean, like I said, we could give away a Gucci belt, a Cuban bracelet, um, and all kinds of stuff, some Jordans, you know, I like all that stuff, man. So, I'm not going to try just to stick to one thing on this channel. Um, I am going to start a family channel, and you know, my kids, I buy them, like, all kinds of stuff, so um, stay tuned for that. But, man, we're going to go ahead and end this video, man. Thank you for your guys' time. I hope you like this. Go buy a Gucci belt.